Hi, my name's Anna, and I just want to talk about my best friend for a few minutes. My best friend, Matt, Matthew Paul Waters, took his life on the 17th of June. It's been 51 days since. It's been the hardest 51 days of my entire life, and I don't think I ever will experience anything harder. This is Matt right here. These were handed out at his funeral. This is one of many journals I've written to Matt since he passed. Every single page filled with my most deepest, darkest thoughts. And this is the dress I wore at my best friend's funeral. And had it on a coat hanger in my cupboard since. Every single day, I ask myself why. I question all the things I could have done better. And maybe there was something I could have said that could have saved his life. And that was one of the most important people in my life. He was there for me like he was there for everyone. He brought a smile to my face and he gave me hope and he gave me strength. Just like a lot of us, Matt felt like no one cared. Like he could leave and wasn't going to affect anyone. I cared. I cared since the second I met him. I'll continue caring for the rest of my life. This is a quote of Matt's I put on a canvas. Because it was my favourite. It was something he said to me. The struggles we go through now are working for us, not against us. For what destroys us creates us eventually. Every single day that my best friend here can turn to to talk to has been the biggest struggle and I'm starting to think it will never get better. I just want every single person watching this to take 10 seconds and remind yourself that you're worth it. If you're having thoughts, you want to take your life, I want you to message me. It isn't that hard, trust me. And I'll be there for you because I wouldn't wish this upon my worst enemy. pain I feel every single day, the sleepless nights, the not eating, seeing my best friend laying there in a coffin, not breathing, and not moving, watching his family crying, knowing how much pain there is every single day. You are worth it. Don't your loved ones through what I've spent every day trying to get away from. I love you so much, Matt, and I'm sorry it took having to lose you to really, you'd really see that. Just in peace, Angel.